Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back. I'm Phil. I'm Sam. We're Bars and Barbells, your favorite reaction channels coming back at you with a new group on the channel. Their mm -hmm. name is Journey. You guys recommended it in the comments, so we're doing it. That's what we do. Follow the comments. Yeah. They've, they've done us well thus far. They have. Honestly, Those, those they have. comments have been fire. They've, yeah. they've given us all the stuff that we need, all the ingredients to make a masterpiece. All the things Chef we never knew fire. existed, which is crazy to me still. Yeah. Now, now the masterpiece I'm referring to is our channel, which <laughs> you need to be subscribed to. Clearly, if you haven't subscribed at this point, I don't know where you've been, but welcome. Glad to have you with us. Yes, and thanks we'd for love, joining us today. Yeah, I'd love to have you with us on this journey going forward. We've always got new content coming, so tomorrow love we'll to have... love to have you on this journey while we're doing journey. Exactly. <laughs> so... The journey continues tomorrow. We got new content every single day that comes out. So you can always look forward to stuff from, you know, music to sports to comedy, all that. Anyways, we got Journey faithfully today. I uh, don't know anything about Journey. This is just, like I said, a recommendation that we got to get to them. They're yeah. a rock band from the 70s, right? And uh, we've done a lot of rock from the 70s now. Yeah. Got more familiar with that sound, the True. type of sound that came through. And yeah. it's interesting going from like the, you know, we did some 50s stuff, some 60s stuff, yeah. 70s, 80s, 90s. So it's really it's cool cool. to kind of see how like they all kind of influenced each other a little the bit. The progression of it, right? Yeah. Yeah. So we're excited to check out Faithfully by Journey. I'm not really sure what to expect. So why don't we just get into it? Let's do it. Let's do it. That's a great time to pause it right there. <laughs> it's it's crazy that you know this is a rock band, right? Because um, really strong piano ballad mm -hmm. to begin with. Yeah. And, you know they've built on it a little bit with the drums, some of the guitars coming yeah, in. The drums coming in, like, was like yeah, sick. a lot of energy in that, and just those you know subtle you know additions, but. Um, it's just interesting because he's definitely like a rock vocalist sound. Mm -hmm. uh, his, his voice is great. I really, yeah, really like it. I do too. Kind of got a little bit of like a Rod Stewart feel. We've done one of Rod mm -hmm. Stewart's songs and um, kind of gave me a little bit of flashbacks <laughs> to that. I'm not saying it's the same or that comparing the two. Yeah. It was just, you know, my initial thought process, you know, because I got to compare some of the stuff that we've been doing thus far. I'm not saying, like I said, that they sound the same. But, um, you know, it, it, I like it. It's a really cool jam. It's, it's, like I said, almost poetry emotion, it feels yeah. like. Yeah. Um, 
you know, we're only midway through, but uh, I feel like we're building up a little bit. That's why I wanted to pause it there because yeah. I think we're going to build into something a little bit more energetic. Yeah, but, especially uh, with the instrumentation, I yeah, feel like. Yeah. yeah, but it was cool, you know, just to see in the beginning and really catch your attention, get you engaged with that build in the piano and uh, then adding his vocal in and, you know, just allowing it to carry the song and now, uh, you know, excited to see where we go. Yeah, no, I really enjoy his vocal as well. I think it's cool. Like, he, it, the sound of it is... is the, you said he sounds a little bit unique and he definitely has that rocky voice but with the powered with the power ballad kind of vibe of the song Mm -hmm. um it's like very different and you know it's also interesting just to kind of hear lyrically the song of him talking about i guess some of the challenges of like you know being a touring musician but obviously like in a relationship where they showed like him looking at a girl and like a kid bringing a kid on a plane and like you know and saying like it's no place for like to raise a family on the road and stuff like that right so you know, I think that that's something that's probably a lot of people in that industry can relate to as well. Yeah, that's the you know, title, Faithfully, right? Yeah. That sums it up. I think you, you summarized it good. All right, let's give them a little bit of a build <laughs> intro up. there, just in case we were about to drop into something. Wondering where I am lost without think of that fire fire yeah i really song? like yeah i really like the drums in this a lot too i feel yeah. like the use of the drum like drums like the placement of it and kind of like bringing it in for a while and then almost pulling it out for a little bit like the heavier pieces of the drums i i know like that stood out to me a lot yeah I, I found the percussion wasn't like too punchy with it like it was it was nice and you know it settled in nicely mm-hmm. with uh, the melody that they had so mm-hmm. um you know i really like that and i also liked how the guitar seemingly played off of the vocal and the lyrics that he was portraying with mm-hmm. the song faithfully and and you know the message and the lyrics yeah. that he talked about i felt like the guitar the electric guitar came in and really emphasized and added to that idea and concept really well yeah. um uh, so that stuck out to me so i really enjoyed my introduction to journey it was yeah. it was fantastic they, uh, you know uh, i i'm surprised i haven't heard of them like because you know i turn in terms of their capabilities it mm-hmm. seems like they I mean, maybe it's just me and I was living under a rock and that's why <laughs> I haven't possible. heard of them. <laughs> yeah. Um, but, you know, I've heard of somebody like Guns N' Roses, for example, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, But, sure. you know, I feel like their level of, you know, capabilities within their music um, 
prowess is is there like it feels like they're pretty epic you know 100%. just from that one song so yeah and like we both said earlier i really enjoy the vocal like his vocal yeah. is very strong as well and i'd be interested to know because like obviously they're deemed a rock band right but like we said this is more of kind of like a power ballad like it wasn't as like hard of rock so yeah. i'd be interested to hear more from them to know if this is more of their vibe or if they have like a wider i guess diversity in their catalog mm -hmm, for sure agree mm -hmm. well you can let us know in those comments and we always appreciate those yes. those messages all that information has have been life-saving and uh really grown our channel to <laughs> be able to experience all this amazing talent so yes. hit those comments now let us know guys you guys always do that i don't even probably have to tell you at this point but <laughs> uh, we really appreciate it nonetheless also you know i forgot to mention this in the beginning we're going through a little bit of uh, change with our our setup we've been going through a moving process our internet's yeah. changed our you know, we're working on getting our lighting sorted, Sound. our microphones, our, you know, all of that stuff. So yeah. camera stuff. So, you know, bear with us if uh, some of these videos in, in terms of the pro growing, growing pains that we have are, uh, you know, not where we want it to be, but it will be soon. Guarantee yes. that. And we always look to improve the channel. So stick with us for now. A couple of growing pains, but hopefully this one came out just fine. You enjoyed it. Nonetheless, hit the like button. Come back tomorrow. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and we'll see you next time.